Hi everyone, it's Philip from BFW1402. Let's go ahead and get our application up and running so you can see what that looks like. So here's our application. Our assignment this week was to create basically an application using a table view, popping up um, a, a detail window showing details about a row that we click. That was our assignment. So I decided what better way to do this than to make a game out of it. So let me click on play here. This is the main detail uh, table that we have there. And there are three sections. Each section is defined by the JSON here. As we can see here, we have three sections. We have strong, and we have cunning, and we have wise. What happens when I click on a character? Well, I can click on a character right here. It opens up a new window inside of a navigation group. And inside that navigation group, it shows me all the details about the character to include his picture, what he's lost, and all of his vital statistics. Because it's in a navigation window, I can click on back and I can go back to choose another character. Let's say I didn't want to play as him, I want to play as Joey, or maybe I didn't want to search for a truffle today, I wanted to search for a whistle. Once we click on let's go, that will actually start the game. And when it starts the game, it'll choose a random location from this location list right here. And this location list has about 34 items inside of it. So it's going to pick four locations from that uh, location list and it's going to display them to you. And then it's going to choose one location to set as the actual location for the item. And so when I click an item, it's going to say, do I take damage? If I do take damage, it'll decrease the damage. It's going to say, do I take energy loss? If I do take energy loss, it's going to decrease that number. And then it's going to check to see whether or not I have guessed the location. So I'm just going to go here and choose a few things and see if I can guess the location, which I did. And inside of the load window here, I have a custom event listener called Game Over that monitors for this win and lose scenario. And every 250 milliseconds, it checks the status. All we're doing is checking to see if the item's been found or our hit points or energy have decreased below zero. If they have, they'll kick off our event, and our event will call the Game Over function, which will show either the win or the lose screen estimate. So that's basically it. So we have several tables in here, we have several windows, and they're all dependent on each other. So I hope you like the game, and uh, it's quite a challenging game if you don't know what you're selecting. Sometimes you'll win, sometimes you won't. And if you don't win, it's going to tell you why you didn't win. And so let's not win here. And we can see that we didn't win because we ran out of health. And it's just a fun little game to play. I hope you guys enjoy. Have a great day.